Hi guys, so today's look is going to be on how I get my spring dewy glowy sort of orangey bronzy skin and just a little eye look to go with it so if you're interested, keep watching. So I was in the middle of creating my eye look and I was like, oh, I have free time so I might as well film a video. Hence why my right eye is not finished, so please ignore that. So the look, the eye look, um, I was going for a bit of a simple cut crease, and I mean really, really simple and soft. Hence why I didn't use like a pencil or a liner or anything like that. I was just working strictly with shadows, only because I didn't want anything too heavy and too bold on the eye. So just to create my own cut crease, I'm just using Sketch, no not Sketch Jennifer, Shadowy Lady. And I'm just applying it to my crease using an eyeliner brush. And I'm just going to blend that out with my fluffy brush just to kind of get a smooth wash of colour. So taking Shadowy Lady, I'm just going to add that to my outer V. I'm really, really simple when it comes to eye makeup. Like, literally, I only worked with three colours today. I just don't like too much going on with my eyes. I don't know, that's just how I am. But yeah, I'm just going to build up that Shadowy Lady in the outer V and just take that into my crease. <laughs> I used the trick um, from my Naked 3 palette. It's like my favourite, favourite eyeshadow ever. It's such a beautiful colour and perfect for spring and summer. It's like a gorgeous rose gold eyeshadow and it's just pinky gold. It's just so nice. So yeah, I apply that on my lid and I'm just blending that out once again just for a smooth transition. <laughs> highlight underneath my eyes and to conceal my dark circles I'm going to be using this concealer by MAC and it's an NC45 and I'm applying this with my Real Techniques Miracle Complexion sponge and I'm absolutely in love with this sponge I think it's one of my staple products in achieving my glowy like spring skin I don't know how it works honestly it just makes my foundation look really nice and dewy and even my concealer I love the way it applies it gives a nice flawless airbrushed finish <laughs> So for that spring glow, I'm going to be using my Giorgio Armani Fluid Sheet in 4 and my Lancome Tint Miracle Foundation in 10. These two together create the perfect spring summer glow. The Fluid Sheet is a liquid illuminator and the Lancome Tint Miracle is amazing, especially if you're going for a dewy, glowy finish. <music> Highlight underneath my eyes. I'm going to be applying my Ben Nye Banana Powder, and this is going to add to that spring glow.
my face, I'm going to be using my MAC Chrome Conceal Palette. And when I'm going for a dewy, glowy finish, I prefer to use cream products as opposed to powders and things like that. So I'm just going to contour my head, my temples and my cheeks for more of a defined look. And I'm using NW55 but also using it with a very light hand because you don't want your contour to be too hard. to my nose I'm going to contour it with a matte eyeshadow and the eyeshadow is called brown down <laughs> So to highlight my cheeks, I'm going to be using my new favourite highlight. Honestly, this camera does not do the highlight justice. I have been using amber lights. I love using amber lights with the sleek blush. It's my favourite combo. It's just so, so gorgeous. Like, you guys need to try it out. For my lips, I'm going to be lining it with cork lip liner. And um, I don't have the clip here for some reason, but I used Honey Love lipstick by MAC and it's just a matte nude lipstick and around it from a bit of like an ombre sort of nude lip but not too obvious I applied a dark brown and the lipstick that I used is called Billy and it's by a UK based cosmetics company called Lila Lee. 